Hello everybody, welcome to a how-to video on how to replace a battery for HP Pavilion X360. The model number on this one particularly is the 14M-DH1003DX. This should work for the other models I have listed in the description on this laptop itself. There's more than one on there, so it should be able to be the exact same video for that those models. So, okay. Alright, you want to turn it over right here you want to make sure you have this is something to pry with to open up the case the case of the laptop like something anything thin like a credit card I'm going to use a back panel of from a desktop computer it has a very thin edge for it to pry with so you got to be careful what you do is you can scratch your you can scratch it up so all right that's what I'm going to use and I'm going to use a Phillips screwdriver a very small one because um, make sure you're going to make because these screws right here you want to make sure they fit these these screws particularly because these are easily get stripped very easy you want to be gentle and careful and you want to make sure it fits firmly in those screws on those screws and there's two more right there's two more under these two pads and it's where the hinges are of the laptop where the, when you lift the lid up these are the hinges right here located and these two pads you got to remove these two pads to, to actually get to the two screws the other two screws. So there's only two. There's only four screws total to open this bo bottom, the bottom of this laptop. So you want to pull this foot off. Be careful. You don't want to ruin the adhesive. Make sure you want to keep the adhesive intact so you can put it back on, like so. So, all right. All right. There we go. As I said, you got to be very careful on these screws right here. You can see, like you see, there's one screw there and there's the other screw there. But and this will be on these particular screws on the front. You got to be careful and you got to make sure you don't. If they be gentle, if they can easily strip. So. That's that one. Don't lose them neither, because you can't replace these screws. Trust they're hard to find. Unless you have a laptop exactly that's broken, they're hard to replace. Trust me. Yeah, you want to. That's why I said be careful when you get them out. Still be even though these are not as bad as those, but still be careful and be gentle with them. You still strip them. Okay, now you're going to need your pry tool. Wherever you use, be, I said, be, care, be careful what you use because uh, you can easily scratch your laptop, but scratch the laptop if you don't do it right. You want to get under the an edge where you can pop the top off. Okay. Find somewhere you got to get underneath this. Like so. And go around it to pop it all up. Be very gentle. There we go. Just like so. All right. The battery is located right here. This is your battery. And when you purchase a replacement battery, you definitely want to check the model of the battery. This is important because there's two types of battery for these. Usually, make sure you get the right model. The model number is located right there. Where it says HP. This is an HT03XL, and there's usually another one. So you want to make sure you get the right battery. You want to get the proper battery for this. Just to let you know, okay? All right. And there's like a screw here, and a couple of screws up here on the top. You got to. 
get out. Be gentle with those screws too. strip them either or lose them. It up, be careful and just pull it right out like so and you have and then there we go then all you want to do you want to take your replacement battery stick it in the same slot like last time like so make sure that's connected right don't make sure it's off or any way or not just make sure of that also okay and go ahead and put your screws back in. Be careful not to lose your screws. Make sure you um, got in there. I, like so. <laughs> now we're... See, try, these are hard to replace. Okay. You don't need to he-man he them in. Just tight them enough, enough to be tight. Okay. That's the end. Okay, now your battery's fastened back tight uh, back in there where it should be. And there you go, pop your, pop your top back on. Get it all the way around. Snapped in. Okay. Put your screws, those four screws back in. Put your rubber feet back on, right? You didn't dirty the adhesive on this on the end. It should stick on there just fine. And for the other two, is that and these? You guys said you got to be very careful when you put them in, and make sure you put them in the right direction. Don't want to try to cross thread these as much as you can and be gentle with them as I said 
They very easily can be stripped. I had done it in the past before myself. That's why I learned not to do that. Okay. Same thing with this one. All right, there you go. As I don't have to heat them in there, just turn it on there tight enough in there. You're all pretty much set to go. If you can, hit the like button, hit that bell notification for future videos, subscribe, and everything else for future videos. I might provide more videos like, like this. This is what I've done in the past, before. Maybe when I started beginning to become a YouTuber, the start of a gamer. Just to let you know. All right, but that's how it's done. I said all the other models are on the below in the description area, how to do it for the same models. I appreciate it and for watching my video. I hope they found this helpful and informative and everything else. Thanks for watching. Peace.